Hi, I'm Joe Vallone, and on today's episode of Backcountry Essentials, I'm going to show you how to make a 3 to 1 Z drag pulley using some standard crevasse rescue equipment. I've built a T slot anchor. If you'd like to know how to build a T slot anchor, please check our other episode on building T slot anchors. First, we will need a ratchet. A ratchet is a progress capturing device and will lock off the raised rope at the anchor. In our scenario, we will demo using the Petzl Micro Traction. When you open the traction, you will notice one side of the device is marked with a load and the other side with a hand. Take care that the load side of the device goes to the load or victim side of the rope. Now, we need a tractor. This is a rope clamp that will allow us to pull on the rope and reset the pulley. Attach the tractor to the load strand going to the victim. This can be done using any traditional hitch, but in our scenario, we will keep it simple and use the T-block from Petzl. To help reduce friction and create a more efficient haul, it is recommended that you pad and prepare the lip. Lay the rope over a shovel handle, shaft of an axe, or ski poles to solve this problem. Before running the system, make sure the end of the rope is closed. In this scenario, you will notice that the back end of the rope is clipped to the anchor. Now we can run our system. Set the tractor as close to the edge as possible and pull the tractor as close to the ratchet as you can manage. The traction will capture your progress while you release the T-block and reset the pulley. Repeat as necessary until you can help your victim. Here's a safety tip. If you find yourself working close to the edge of the crevasse, be sure to protect yourself as a rescuer and tie into the anchor with a long leash or into the back end of the rope. So now you know how to make a 3 to 1 Z-drag pulley using a micro traction for your ratchet and using a T-block for your tractor.